All right, let's check in with the Minecrafters, shall we? Oh. Yeah, that's even more interesting than the face reveal. So as you guys can tell, Dream has attempted to use the Men in Black neutralizer and essentially said, never mind my face reveal. That never happened. I'm just gonna cover my face again. Overall, I don't think that's ever happened before, so this makes it a little bit more interesting. His reasoning is also even more interesting. And all of this on top of the way he face revealed in the first place makes it very interesting. So for all of you guys who don't remember, let me go through the whole Dream face reveal saga. So if we go back a couple years, Dream was probably pulling 60 million views of video, he was absolutely killing it. Probably one of the largest gaming creators ever on the platform. Then two things happened, which I think is pivotal to his career. The whole ordeal where he created this Minecraft speed run and he cheated on it. And that was kind of a funny situation because you had a portion of people who were very mad at him. And then you had a whole another portion of people who just thought the whole situation was hilarious. And the other thing was this picture leaked of him. And now that was really all speculation if this was actually him. It was never really confirmed. So on high insight, it seems like that was actually Dream. And what I think happened was Dream wanted to prove the world that he didn't look like that because sadly he was just being mean for being fat. So he spent roughly a year going through one of the wildest body transformations because if that's the before and after, kudos to Dream because that is a lot of dedication to get this result from that. But his whole face reveal came across as, hey guys, look, I'm not fat. Because when it was finally time for him to face reveal, every single content creator with some clout was posting a video on Twitter going, oh wow, you look so good. That's crazy. I would never think Dream looked like that. That's what you look like, dude? And then when he finally face reveals, he's just some dude. He just looks like your average guy. And that's coming from an average guy. Welcome to the club, bud. And then people went straight to the AI tools trying to confirm the original leaked photo was him, which according to most of these facial recognition tools was true. And he got dunked on more. Then suddenly he was seen in content that wasn't extremely planned out Minecraft videos for engagement and his views started tanking. And when I say tanking, I'm comparing to his old videos. Like if you take a look at his channel, it's not dying. He's one of the top creators out there. He's very influential, which makes his act even more confusing to me because it seems like despite his incredible size on the internet, internet comments really affect him. And clearly the people around him because of this video that he posted on his main channel, that becomes pretty apparent. The new mask is cool, but how he scripted his friends to act, that's a little bit odd. Because the reason I'm making this video is because he posted a video titled, Bye from Dream. This is such a weird approach to me because like, why is he giving all these comments attention? Dream, what? we need to talk now. We have a big problem. Ever since you took this stupid mask off, you've fallen off. You're irrelevant, you have no money, no views, you're trash. It's the truth. You've ruined us. There's nothing I can do about it. I feel like it's already- Oh, they're actually- Put the mask off. I mean, they're being hyperbolic here, but still. I've already faced reveal. Delete, delete, delete everything. everything. Delete, delete it, go, go back. On it. When you go back to what, seven months ago? Oh, the, will the views come back, you think? Probably. Why, I mean, they can't get any lower than they are now. They ain't gonna hurt. I mean, they say that, but as of watching this video right now, he is number one on trending. IRL stuff then, I can't go- Yeah, you can go. Put the mask off. Put the mask off. Do everything you do now. With the mask off. If you never took it off, we'd be better. Am I that ugly? Yes. Just put it. I mean, I don't know. This is such an interesting video because I mean, like the dude pulled what 30 million views on a face reveal. It's probably the most seen face reveal ever. Yeah, well why he's leaning into the hate is a little bit confusing to me. See, how am I meant to put the mask back on? I can't see through it. I can't even see. I can't even see. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Weird flex. <laughs> I can't see. I need it. Wait. So when I got the call from Dream, and he told me a little bit about what he had in mind, I didn't know if it was gonna be the best job or the worst job of my entire career. I mean, we worked on some complicated projects before. Spider-Man, Batman, Black Panther, Daft Punk. I mean, if you've ever seen his face, you know why Dream needs the mask. He needs all the help he can get, if I'm being honest. It took some late nights and a few different prototypes, but we got it down just right eventually. So we started off by doing some 3D head scans of Dream to map out digitally the exact size and shape of his head. Once we had that base form, our crew could get to work on the design and engineering of the mask. So the mask is 3D printed actually from laser fused nylon powder. It's hand painted and hand reinforced for the ideal balance of durability to weight. It takes a long time because everything, I mean, the fit, 
the balance. I mean, that's a really sick mask. mask. It's got to be spot on for it to work. We think it's awesome. But I'm still like confused in why he feels the need to bring back the character like that. Like it wasn't that mask that made him the popular creator he is today. It's his engaging Minecraft videos. It's like the start of a YouTube horror movie. Ah, yes! Stop it! Yes! We're back! Oh, yes! Wait, what's bring back Manhunt? I'm trying to understand this. Like, okay, wait, so do they genuinely believe that him putting a mask on makes him more relevant again? Because like, obviously they are like half joking about like, oh, we're gonna make so much money again. We're, we're gonna go viral again. We'll take back the, the, the bad face reveal. But like, isn't it because they moved in together, they got distracted, they stopped making the content that made them popular in the first place? Wouldn't that be the view decline? Or have I completely missed this? Now I can't say I have been paying attention to these guys actively. Last time I checked in on dream was uh the last video we made on him where he made this very odd thread on quackity which essentially just was dream writing an entire novel and quackity leaving him on red so dream just posts the whole novel for the whole world to see so that was um definitely a minecraft moment thank you dream very cool again this is another minecraft moment um best of luck to dream do they have any announcement at the end of this video let's bring back bananas <laughs> Yeah! Never take it off. What if, what if we're taking the video and you're in the background? Like, stupid. Everything would be it for nothing. Like this. For so nothing. No, everyone's gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, well, if someone posts a new one, sue them. Everyone's gonna like you again. You're gonna be back. A million views of videos. What if we're back? What if I meet a. a Meet someone. So I deleted the face reveal. Oh, no, you're not meeting any. It girls. didn't happen anymore. And even if you did, yeah. there's definitely going to be re-uploads of it now. All times, baby. All the time. It never comes off. It never comes off. Okay, so mm -hmm. even, even if I want to go to, let's say, go eat, we go to McDonald's. I don't think you're getting you it. Shovel that food underneath. No, okay. no more face. No. Only mask. Okay, why well, am I hungry? Let's. I want to go to McDonald's. Yeah, of course you do. Whatever. Let's go. Okay. Welcome to McDonald's. Will you be using the mobile app today? No. So is he a hazard while driving with that thing on? <laughs> I don't understand that decision, but hey, I'm also not the target audience here. Is this hype for the Dream fans? I don't know. But I mean, that's a cool mask. Mimulus has a more practical mask though, because you can just take it off and wash it and have 80 of them without any problem. I feel like Dream's mask must smell awful after a full day of using it, but hey, that's not my problem. What I am confused about is why Dream is doing this instead of just focusing on engaging content that gave him his career in the first place. But I guess, hey, this is maybe a stepping stone for him to do that again. Or it could also be a stepping stone for him to branch out more, but that's what I thought the face reveal was. So um, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I don't understand Dream's actions just like a whole lot of people. I just hope he did this for himself and wasn't pressured into doing it like he was heavily alluding to in this video. But did you know there was a TikToker who became a fugitive of the state for living in the forest for seven months and he documented everything and posted on TikTok, including the police showing up to arrest him? Well, it actually happened and it's an absolutely insane story you should check out here and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.